Steady rain and slick streets always can be a dangerous combination when you're out on the road. Makes for a very busy day, in some cases for first responders. Our Olivia Leach rode along, in fact, with MedStar today. They had to respond to several accidents because of the weather today. She's joining us live in Fort Worth with the best advice so we don't end up being one of their calls. Something we never want to be, Olivia. That's right, Doug. Yeah, we rode along with John Hamilton, a paramedic supervisor today, and he says a lot of the accidents they see on days like this are easily preventable. When it hasn't rained for a while, the roads get the oil on them and they become slick when that uh, water hits them, when the rain hits them, and these conditions are just horrible for trying to drive on. John Hamilton is an operations supervisor with MedStar. Rainy days like today keep him busy. Accident calls tend to go into overdrive. People hitting each other, they're running into the median, they may be running off of the road. This man says a speeding driver caused him to crash his truck into a median. Car real close on my butt and it just started hydroplaning. I hit the wall right there and it slid over here. John says drivers should slow down on rain soaked streets. Generally, what we see the reason for these accidents is people driving too fast for the conditions. They don't leave enough space between the vehicle in front of them and they don't leave enough room to react to a sudden stop. He also says avoid driving into standing water. If you're hydroplaning, then you're moving uh, uncontrolled because you, you've lost your ability to steer. It might take you a little longer to get home, but you could be saving your life and others. Sometimes the outcome is a lot worse than just banging up your vehicle. Uh, it could be hospitalized or, or even worse. Another thing to keep in mind, if you see a first responder at the scene of an accident, you should move over a lane and make sure to go slower. It could save a life. Live in Fort Worth, Olivia Leach, CBS 11 News. All